It all started with me buying a pinball machine. It quickly broke. <laughs> and I finally started figuring out how to fix it. I started buying video games after that. Nobody knew what I was up to. You know, it was typical Jeff collecting something different. You know, he's probably lost his mind. But in reality, I was buying machines to open this arcade bar. I'd heard of this concept in other cities, but I finally saw one in Chicago. The second I walked through those doors, it was that light bulb moment where I'm like, holy crap, this could be me in Indianapolis. We started checking out multiple arcade bars to see what they're doing. And I was spending every dime that I could get my hands on to buy arcade games. The one thing we didn't have was cash. We just started this campaign and we said, you know, if we really want this, maybe other people really want this, and we can open this all together as Indianapolis. We are local, we are small, we want to keep it that way. We're just super passionate about this. We feel very lucky to be here.